but God took it. And if you go to the book of Hebrews, chapter 11, verse 5, we find out that Enoch had, not only did he walk with God, but he had a walk with God that pleased God. And it pleased God so much until God began to let Enoch in on a little secret. And that secret was, if you go to Jude, the verse 14, you'll find out what the secret is. The secret was, judgment is coming, Enoch. Oh, yeah. Even though you've discovered me, there's a whole world of people who ignore me and judgment is coming. Mm -hmm. Judgment is coming and I love you so much, Enoch, that I got to take you out of harm's way. Mm -hmm. Let me end with this. How many of us are convinced that our walk with God is so exceptional that God not only will warn us of danger, but he'll take us out of dangerous situations that threaten our relationship with him. Right. Not only, Enoch, am I going to tell you what's going to happen, but I'm going to take you out of some stuff that's dangerous to your life. I'm going to rescue you because judgment is coming. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And we're going to deal with the judgment next week. Judgment is coming, Enoch. And, and it says in Jude that Enoch preached this message. I didn't know Enoch was a preacher. <laughs> that Enoch preached this message that the Lord is coming with multitudes of his angels to judge the ungodly. Mm -hmm. And he takes, he, he lets Enoch preach this message for 300 years. Can you imagine preaching the same message for 300 years? Mm. Enoch preached the same message for 300 years. Nobody got saved. So God took Enoch out of here. Enoch, I got to take you on out of here. I'm not going to allow you to die with these crazy people. Enoch, come on. You walk with me. Let's stand.